Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Humbly Yours. Um, today I decided that I would do a plan with me. So I'm going to go ahead and um, set up my next month um, budget, pretty much. So let's go ahead and get started. Now, um, the planner that I'm using, this is the um, <laughs> Plum Paper Ultimate Financial Planner. And you can you can have it um, customized to have a way you you like. This is what I chose, and um, I hadn't really filmed anything uh, this month because it was just a lot going on, and there still is. I'm not quite um, done with what I want to do as far as my channel goes. I've been using my um, cell phone. And I'm ready to go ahead and just get another camera and another tripod and just really so I'll be satisfied so I can get the ball rolling here on my channel when, so that I can really uh, be more inspired, should I say, uh, to do videos. And it's been so hot lately, so I decided that I will film in the morning and while it's still cool outside and everything. So let's just go ahead and get started because I'm kind of like rambling a little bit. <clears throat> All right, so this is the first page um, in here. These two pages here, I'm going to start with these. I've already done my calendar for the month. Uh, let's see, where is it at? I already have this already um, decorated and set up. The sticker kit that I'm using, I gotten, I have a subscription to Plum Paper, so I get these sticker kits every month. The subscription um, is only $10 a month, and I'll leave a link to Plum Paper below if you're interested in uh, purchasing or subscribing to their sticker kits or even purchasing one of their planners. You guys will really love it. It gives you um, a thorough way of customizing your planner to your fitting. This is just a financial planner, but they do have others. I am in no way affiliated with them. I just like their product. Okay, so I already have the month, my monthly calendar set up. So now I'm going to go back to this page, these two pages, and get them uh, set up. So we're going to start with this page here. And I'm going to use these um, stickers out of the kit. This first one um, is basically like a tracker. And you can set it up however way you want. So I'm going to put this right there. I'm going to set this here and you don't have to, you know, use these, of course, you know, you can set these three um, goals up however way that you like. I just wanted to add some color to it, even though I'm the one, <laughs> of course, I chose the, um, the neutral color for my planner. All right. So we got that. All right. Let's see here. Um, Okay, so I'm going to go back to this here, and I think I'm going to use this, this one here for these. This one. Oh, geez. I'm having a hard time. Okay. And put birthdays. And I'm not sure what I'm going to put right there. Oh, well, no. I'll go ahead and put events. I don't think I have anything coming up, but you never know. My great nephew's birthday is this month. Okay. <clears throat> And put that 
Yeah. Uh, okay. It all depends what's on this next page. All right. So, so income. So, paycheck number one. Paycheck number two. My expected amount is eight seventeen forty. Okay. Um, okay. So let's just go ahead and go ahead down to the fixed expenses. So. <clears throat> My fixed expenses are, of course, let me see here, my rent. This is, I'm just going to, I'm only going to be putting down whatever my amount, my half is. Me and my boyfriend, we split the um, bills in half. So this is just my half, and then I have my own separate bills. So I think I'm going to list all the bills that we split in half first. So rent. Um, spectrum, uh, okay, gas, electric, oh, that's not, shoot, <laughs> those aren't fixed because those are variables, they I never know for sure what they're going to be. So let's see if I can wipe this out. I'm out. Hold on, guys. Okay. Still some in there. Unless I'm at the end. All right. Um, I have another one. Oh. Oh, I'll just go ahead and open up a new pack. I hope you guys have been great and been staying safe during this time. I'm trying not to make this video long because I don't want my camera to cut off on me. All right, so. There we go. All right, so, okay, so my dish is $179. Uh, $179.37. <coughs> okay, so we split that. Da, 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 da. Those are always the same. Okay, then I'll just move on to the other one. So, um, oh, my plum paper subscription is ten dollars. Uh, you know what? I was only supposed to put. <laughs> Woo. All right. Okay. That's the one that doesn't work. I'm going to need my calculator and let me just fix these two right here. I don't know why. This wants to give me a hard time. It's not supposed to go on rough like this. It's just going to make it horrible to write. All right, let's try. Spectrum. Okay, so my half. I'm gonna say eleven fifty. 
then 8969 8969 okay all right so now all right so what else okay what's fixed what's always the same um i have two buddy then um my youtube this subscription is so that um even when i when i watch videos um i don't always want to see commercials and um of course you know you have access to watching certain movies that's on there as well um okay so youtube let's see fixed okay so spectrum dish that 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 okay my phone bill is always the same this is just my bill and in fact let me put a star by the ones that me and him split <clears throat> my phone bill always stays the same and i believe i believe that's it as far as this part part goes um okay okay now um you know what i do have one that i want to take care of and that's my chase account so i want to start reducing this here um my savings okay so for my savings i use uh chime and Chime, what Chime does when I, and I, I don't know what took me so long because I've had it for a minute now, but I don't know what took me so long to realize is this is that, okay, so I have a spending account on with my Chime account and I also have a savings. And whenever I spend anything off of my Chime, what it does is, is that it rounds up the difference up and then puts it towards the savings. Um, for example, um, if something costs four dollars and for instance my, my tube buddy if i pay my tube buddy bill off of my chime account it'll take it around it up it around it up to five dollars which is 50 cents and it'll take that 50 cents and send it to my savings account so it i can help build that up that way um since i sometimes you know have an issue with saving money that way that'll help me okay so i'll just look at that as my backup money okay and then um so yeah that's what i'm going to do with that i already have my calendar set up um over here is my color coding system and i'm going to be using these colors from now on and i have to write it down because i have been had it set up a different way but i want to try something different um it's something that i saw um, while i was watching the budget mom and i want to try to use or incorporate her system into my budgeting and see if that will help me out so that's what i'm going to do um let me see. So I won't have to use this yet, of course, until starting next week, beginning with the 31st. So that's what I'll be doing uh, next month. Next week, I should say. Um, so basically, um, I'll be highlighting things in, this, in these colors. Some things I know exactly when they're going to be paid. So for instance... Um, my rent is due on uh, the 1st. And something else I'm going to be doing too. I ordered me some um, stickers from Chrissy Ann Designs. And um, they're box stickers. And I, I'm i going to use the colors that's on there to mark uh, the bills um, beginning in October. Because I'm not sure when those stickers will be coming. It still says the order is processing. Um, I mean, they could come today, but I don't know that. And if they do, I'll just cover this up. It doesn't, you know, it's not that big of a deal or wipe this out and cover it up. But I just wanted to go ahead and show you guys how I set up my uh, calendar for my budget for the month. So on the first of the month is when my rent is due. And that's $345. Um, generally... 
my spectrum bill is due around the fourth or the fifth of the month i'm going to say the fourth because it's a friday so spectrum and that's uh i paid that bill usually that's that is not the right amount 22.99 okay and then let's see here not gonna mark it yet but i do know that um my spectrum i mean not my spectrum but my water bill is going to fall around i'll say between the 14th and the 16th of the month and then what i know for sure comes out every month on the same date is going to be my tube buddy so without me having to knock stuff off here so tube buddy And that's four dollars and fifty cents on the twenty third. It's usually my phone. And actually, I'm gonna change this because they've been taking it out uh, around the eighth of the month. So I'm put my phone here. Um, let's see here. Um, oh, um, so on, okay. And then, so my dish bill definitely comes out on the 23rd. And my half is 89.69. Oh, also on the first is my plum paper. I don't know why I write the, wrote that so far apart. Ugh. Okay. This is why I need <laughs> white out. I'm going to stock up on some of this too. Okay. Plum paper. And I do write better than this. I don't know what's going on with my handwriting. Um, let's see here. Ish. YouTube. It's on the 28th. It's $12.99. Okay. I believe that that is it. So how my new system is going to work is... Um, well, basically, when you budget, I budget paycheck, paycheck to paycheck. So I know that I have whatever yesterday that was my payday. So my August, let's see here. Uh, where is it at? Okay. So my August 28th paycheck, I know that. My rent is coming out. My rent is coming out. My YouTube, my plum paper um, is coming out of my uh, August 28th paycheck. So all of those should all be paid up within this week. Then um, I get paid again on the 11th. So what I'll do is... So what I do is I just go through and I look and see, okay, I get paid on the 11th. What bills are going to be coming out that check before my next pay, which is going to be um, my tube bay um, account and my uh, dish. So I will be paying those two bills on those um, out of that paycheck on September the 11th, and then I'll get paid again on the 25th and out of that check I know it'll be my um, YouTube um, subscription um, also my rent because I won't get paid again until October so I am going to be doing that and also what I'm going to be doing out of um, 
the September 11th paycheck is take out half of my portion of the rent so I can try to get ahead on that part. <clears throat> now, as far as uh, my cash envelopes and everything, I will be doing another video for that. I just wanted to come on and show you guys this real quick. And um, if you like this, if you like this video, just please hit like. And if you would like to follow me on my budgeting journey, please hit subscribe and ding the bell so that you can get a notification every time I post a video. Um, I will be linking um, or leaving links for my tube buddy, um, the plan, the plum paper, <laughs> plan paper, the plum paper. Um, and let's see what else. And also uh, Chime. Now, you can um, use me as a reference if you decide that you want to check out Chime and subscribe with them. And by doing so, um, you'll receive a gift from them and I will also receive a gift from them. So I'll leave those links in my video below. And you guys have a great day. Peace.